Hi there. Um, I wanted to talk a little bit about um, a pay-to-play game called Town Star by Gala Games. The um, website to get started is app.gala.games and just go and sign up for a, an account there. If you use my link, you can get uh, some points for that. Um, when you go into the game, the first thing that you have to know about is to pick a location. Now, for the locations, there are different things to consider, and you'll probably need to watch more than just one video to know a strategy behind picking a great location, but just know that these um, these are rivers. You can see that it's got a brown edge next to it, and then the oceans have a white edge to kind of signify salt, I guess. And so um, if you click on it, if you're not sure what it is, you click on it and it'll tell you what it is. <clears throat> this is a city. And if you scroll back with your mouse uh, scroll button, you can see that we've got a world view here, basically, um, that you can choose any location in the world. But like I say, you, because of gasoline costs, and I'll go over that in a, in a video in more detail, you want to pick closer to a city than like over here this this uh, notice that they have low points they picked a spot that is not close to a city therefore it's harder to manage and uh, it's not impossible but it's just harder um, so there are certain places that uh, that won't let you add a city if you notice it didn't come up and say add down here but it tells me it's a forest but it won't let me add it well right now they have not implemented air travel and this uh property here all this land is um only accessible by sea there is no city on this whole thing so if you can't get by the water so that you could use a boat then you can't obviously build your town there because um, you would have no way to sell items and so that that is the case with some of this stuff these are mountains mountains provide um, shade but they also uh, which means that's not good for your crops but they also provide ability to mine which if you're going to do um, uh, a winery, for example, or if you want to make wine bottles, you're going to need to be able to mine to get those products. If you want a um, a nuclear power plant instead of just a regular power plant, then you're going to be able to you're going to need to be able to mine for those items. Okay, and um, the dark green is a forest. The lighter grain are plains, and the desert is white or uh, beige color, uh, the color of sand, pretty much. So there are advantages and disadvantages to um, starting in each of the territories, and I will make another video on exactly how to do that. But right now. Uh, uh, this is just a basic uh, overview of where to pick a location. Here's a city, and if I wanted to start in the desert, I could start here. If I wanted to have access to water, which would be good if in the desert a lot of people want to make silica, which is used for making glass, but they just sell the silica itself. They're, they're mass producing it. So then you need a ship right now called a, um, there is a trade pier, which is uh, for selling 10 items. And 10 is the minimum for selling. 
And then there is also called a freight pier, which you can sell 100 items. Now they, they have a trade depot, which you can sell a truck like this right here, where you sell 10 items. Right now, they don't have a freight depot, or at least not for free. Maybe they have them in NFTs where you can sell 100 items at a time by road. Right now, um, it's only 10. So the, if you want to build over here, for example, or anywhere that's not next to the water, you cannot sell but 10 items at a time unless you have some other method that I'm unaware of. Okay, so basically when you're building your town, you say place your town here. Yes, this is where I want to um, place it. And you name your town. Um, when, if you're doing the competition server, it starts on uh, every Tuesday at noon Eastern Standard Time. So if you um, if you want to get a town in a hurry, most likely you want to uh, type out your town name and highlight it and do a copy command so that when you t go to place your town, you can just click here, paste it, and and then click OK. Um, unless you're a really fast typer. Uh, so here's Here's the town starting. The, re the way I'm moving around is the scroll button moves me in and out however I want to. And if I hold the right um, mouse key and I can move side to side, it will rotate my world here. Um, if, you, if I left click it, I can drag it, drag it back and forth however I want. So scroll. Uh, right click or left click and move. Okay, so the way that you make money is you sell things. Uh, this is the Trade Depot and sell. And let's see, it sells. It's going to be um, all the same price, is um, but the time is going to be less at the very top one and the gasoline cost is less at the top one so there's no other no reason to ever choose anything except the top one so if you do uh, if i click sell there and everything that you click on like this depot that i clicked on you can't just click out in front of the truck or whatever you have to click at the base of every block that you want to see okay and so I just sold wheat because wheat is what you start off growing, okay? Um, this pond gives water to that. I'll go over all these things in a later video, more detail. I'm just showing you how to get started. So uh, that's basically it, um, right? You start off with 25 thousand dollars and right now you can see that it's ticking away you've got a timer here that lasts one minute every minute it uh, clicks off and you have to pay wages the way you know what wages you pay like this right here for the trade depot it says twenty dollars per minute okay the farmer ten dollars per minute um, this worker $20 per minute. So 20, 20, and 10. $50 per minute is um, what I'm paying for wages. And I'll go over those details in another video. You start with nine wood, and this is your uh, wood shed that you start with. It only holds 10, but you start with nine. And the reason why I believe that they do that instead of starting you with a full um, woodshed is because they don't want you to sell your wood because that, that would mess you up entirely if you sold your wood in the beginning, um, especially in the desert or the uh, plains because you don't start with trees. 
Okay, so you click on that, and I got 10 points, okay? Uh, you don't get many points for a week. The more complicated the items that you create are, the more points you get when you sell them. And when the deep, when the trade gets back and you click on it, that's how you get points or if it automatically uh, registers the points. But if it's just sitting there, you won't have points and you won't have the money. So if you're sitting, if this starts blinking red and you're about to be out of money and you're like, well, I sold, I don't know what's going on. If you look and it's not clicked on, then that will cause that problem. The fuel storage starts at 40 gasoline. Okay. So before you run out, you're going to want to be producing gasoline or you might be in trouble. So that is the location guide and a little bit of uh, explanation about getting started. And I will make some more detailed videos. Thank you for watching. Like, share, and subscribe.